Hi there, this is Jeff Worden from Tech That Doesn't Bite, and today I'm answering a question! <laughs> Jeff, I got a question about Gold Wave, and I hope you could offer some advice on it. Recently, I am studying vocabulary for an English exam. A friend of mine passed me a lot of vocabulary MP3s, and each of the MP3s has a fixed pattern. First they read the vocabulary, then pause for one second, then followed by a detailed explanation of that vocabulary, around three to five seconds, then pause for one second again. The cycle keeps repeating in this pattern. I just want to focus on the pronunciation of the vocabulary first, rather than the explanation section. In order to remove the three to five second noise, I tried the following steps. I used the effect, filter, silence reduction, and change the parameters like dB from the default negative 48 decibels to zero decibels, and it doesn't seem to work. CS, thank you for writing this question. The process of silence reduction is to remove the silent slash quiet parts of a given audio clip and then replace it with a length of silence that you choose and at what volume you want to set it for. So this is probably not the best way to go about removing the explanation parts in your audio clip, uh, despite there being a pattern. Uh, this, however, can work to your advantage. So that being said, if you're looking to remove or silence some audio, unfortunately, the quickest way to do it would probably be to simply delete it out. Uh, this can be a mildly time-consuming process, uh, depending on how many items you need to cut out. You know, if it's about 20, it's probably not that big of a deal. If it's 100, okay, yeah, it's going to be a while. But it's probably one of the more efficient ways of doing audio editing, at least for what you're trying to accomplish. Okay. So if you're looking to remove the explanation bigger parts, you can just highlight and delete them. But for you, you want to just hear the words, but not sporadically, I would imagine. So let's do this. Let's set each of the words one second apart from each other. Now, it doesn't have to be one second. It could be two seconds, five seconds, whatever works for you. But for our sake, we'll just do one second apart. So what I suggest is that first you create a new one second file. So you click new up here and then select one second, all right? Then you hit OK, and then you just cut this out. Hit Cut, and then close this out, like that. All right, let's re-maximize this. And then what you're going to do is you are going to replace uh, the, the explanation part of it. So you're going to highlight from the end of the first word to the beginning of the second word, basically highlighting this section here, and then you can click on Replace. Now, if you want to be more efficient about this, you can press Control R. So I'll do that, and then you just keep going and doing it. Lather, rinse, and repeat, and you are essentially finished. And there you go. And then when you play it, Control A, you get this. Tech that doesn't bite. CS, I hope this answers your question, or at least makes the process of what you want to do more efficient, so that it isn't a big time-consuming effort. Uh, I definitely encourage you to play around with some other possibilities within Gold Wave, but if it's one thing I've learned, especially when it comes to audio and video editing, sometimes you just have to sit and do the work to accomplish what you want done, and there isn't always a quick and easy way to do it. It is what it is. Anyways, thank you again for writing to us. Please do like and subscribe to Tech That Doesn't Bite here on YouTube and your favorite podcast app. Along with that, please come and visit techthatdoesntbite.com where you can learn more about me and Simon, see how awesome we are, and see all the other tech reviews and questions we've answered. Thank you for joining us. Have a great one. We hope you enjoyed today's episode. Please like and subscribe to Tech That Doesn't Bite, and be sure to click on the notifications button so you'll know when we update this channel. Also, come and check out our website at techthatdoesntbite.com. Have a great day.